Hey, what's up, guys? It's us back with another video, and today I will show you how you can get pretty much any Steam game for free. So, what you are gonna do first is you're gonna go ahead and download uTorrent. As you can see, I have it right here. So, once you have downloaded uTorrent, you're gonna go ahead and go into your web browser and go into no steam. Oh, no steam. Ro. And this web page is gonna come up. So. It's gonna come up a lot of pop-ups right now because of them. Um, they need to earn money because they upload games for free that actually cost money. So what you're gonna do is gonna play, press close, close, um, and close, and Get up. leave uh, close. So now I have now once I have pressed close enough times, this will come up and I can um, remove that. Um, tab and I can also remove this one because it was a pop-up okay so now you just gonna decide what game you want to download so I'll be used the uh, pick one real quick I will just pick South Park the stick of truth okay so you're gonna press click here once you've done that you are going to download the game which is this one right here so you're gonna press any of these two links I will press this one um, okay oh and I got a pop-up you can just remove the pop-ups all the time if you want that uh, but okay so I am waiting for it to be okay I need to wait even more Now I can skip that. Okay, so I'm gonna get into this depositfiles.com webpage, uh, and you are gonna press um, this download right here because this one you need to pay for. This one is gonna take a while, and you also need it's gonna take maybe a few hours, maybe one hour. It depends on the file size on you turn it as well if it's a big file it can take up to like 10 hours six hours um, but yeah it depends on the internet as well so once you've done that you're just gonna wait the 60 seconds and I will be back with you once the 60 seconds have been counted down Okay, so now the 60 seconds have been counted down. I'm just gonna check that I'm not a robot because I think I am not a robot. Then you're gonna press continue and download file. Sometimes you need to uh, enter a text instead of pressing I'm not a robot, but it's easy, very easy. So it's gonna press download file and it's gonna start to download. So I will be back with you again once this download is done. Invincible. Okay, so the file has finally been downloaded, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna press it. And once you press it, um, this little window right here will come up. So I have made a folder for my games in my C drive. Uh, I will show you it right here, this PC, uh, this computer, and local C. So what you're gonna do is you can do this like me, I have it in games, and you're just gonna press OK. So, once you see the destination, destination folder is set as you want it, you're just gonna press install. So this is gonna install, this is gonna go pretty quick, and now it's gonna come up a lot of pop-ups. But it's okay, it's not, nothing to worry about, just don't press anything on the pop-ups websites, okay? Uh, so, now uTorrent will come up. As you can see, this is not a very big size file, so... You're just gonna make sure every every single file is checked and press OK. And now you can also press in here. You're just gonna press Ctrl A and right click and priority and set to high. So what this does is that it makes the uTorrent download uh, prioritized over everything on your computer. If you're gonna play like any game while doing this, don't set it to high. You set it let it be on normal. 
it's okay so i will be back with you once the download is done so uh, see you soon okay so the download is finally done as you can see so what you're gonna do now is you're just gonna double press this file right here and a folder will pop up now it says open only part one all other parts will install so you're only gonna open part one uh, you don't need to read this first you can read this first if you want to um, but I will not read this you can also see here though the minimum system requirements to be able to run the game uh, but I will not read this because I know my PC can handle it and stuff so you're just gonna run this folder this program not folder uh, right here it's part one as you can see here is part two so I'm just gonna double press it and let's see yeah, this can sometimes take a while for the like, program to open up, so just be patient and wait for it. Okay, so it kind of have been loaded, you might get this screen, and, and by the way, if it doesn't come up anything in like 10 minutes, you can go ahead and try and run it as an administrator, that might work, but, oh well, so... Okay, this screen popped up for me, just gonna go ahead and press run, and it's going to load again. And, okay, it loads more, so I will be back with you again when the download, or when the loading is done. Okay, so I got a sneaky one as you can see right here if the like a yellow thing is uh, like flashing right here you're just gonna press it and you can't see now but because it's user account control um, so you're just gonna press yes and it's going to start up a window like we saw when we installed the thing for the first time before we did it in uTorrent so it will show up pretty soon I hope okay there we go so here it is as you can see so it's already a destination folder in games so you're just gonna press install it's going to install everything for you now all the and um, like uh, installation one and it's in um, the part one and the part two um, it was only two parts in this one uh, other ones have like up to six parts I have seen uh, but I will be back with you uh, once this download is done so see you soon okay so the download is now done and it will just disappear by itself some pop-ups will show up and um, yeah you just gonna close all of them and you can download a patch if you want to I am currently downloading a patch I can show you in the next video I can do an extra video to show you the patch as you can see it's gonna take like almost an hour to download this so I will not do it in this video but I will do another video to download the patch and show you how it works so okay so let's get back into it um, well it's gonna you can just turn this down and as you can see right here I have the game so let's just open it up and um, just going to see if we can make this work because as you can see I'm recording with OBS and I have it on my second monitor so it's gonna double press open it and Okay, so it is on this screen, so he's going to... So, okay, so it's on my other screen, so I'll be back with you once I have fixed the game capture. So, be right back. Okay, so I am back, and as you can see, the game is working perfectly fine. Um, yeah. 
yeah so can you skip through this oh shit sorry for that okay that should be better I didn't realize that the screen was not fixed okay seems like it's still not so you're gonna have to live with it that the screen is not perfect so he's gonna press new game um, and um, yeah that's it for this video so if you did enjoy the video um, deep in the lands of Zaran the humans of Koopa Cape struggle to stop okay so I will pause it right there because it's very loud so if you did enjoy the video um, smack that like button and if you're new please subscribe and leave a comment if you want to see any other videos like that or what kind of videos you want to see on my channel um so i will see you in the next video i'm out peace